way too. Y'all you know saying Jack Conrad in your estimates? Everybody hit up. Jake Paul revealed relieved that Mike Tyson took another. Oh shit. All right, man, make sure you stay blessed. Make sure you stay in the comments. Get us his reaction. I don't think it's weird, though. Whatever I'm afraid to do, I do it. I think Jake Paul's going to hurt. I think this is a very dangerous fight for Paul. I, Interesting. I think he might be making a mistake. Because, first of all, for me, he, he don't got a lot other than money, and he's made plenty of money. But as the fight gets closer, the less nervous I become because it's reality. And in reality, I'm invincible. I think I'm just like wired differently to like, I, I just feel like it's like destiny for, to, for me to be involved in this. In a surprising turn of events, Jake Paul expressed relief upon learning that his highly anticipated bout with boxing legend Mike Tyson in Texas this summer would be classified as an exhibition match. The announcement marks a significant shift in the nature of the fight. Prompting varied reactions. Nigga saying exhibition and shit like I know that word. Bro, just say the fight is gonna be good. You know what I'm saying? But W W reaction, man. You know what I'm saying? We we when is this fight gonna happen? That's what I wanna know. I you know what I'm I'll be reacting to all these videos and I don't know the date. I will be there when that not be there, literally. <laughs> I'm broke. I'm talking about I'll watch it on the uh, internet, man, you know what I'm saying? From the boxing community. You know, sixty not what sixty was thirty years ago. Yeah. Sixty's very young now. Amidst the anticipation surrounding the showdown between YouTube sensation Jake Paul and former heavyweight world champion Mike Tyson, a recent revelation has added a new layer of intrigue to the upcoming bout. Recently, it was disclosed that the bout scheduled for July 20th will not be officially recorded on the fighters' records. This revelation came as Tyson clarified that the event would be categorized as an exhibition match, reminiscent of his previous exhibition bout against Roy Jones Jr. in 2020. The biggest fight offer you've ever been offered. I don't want to lose to a fucking YouTuber. So I'm like slightly scared, but that's going to be like motivating. It's going to be motivating me to, to be on edge and to not take him lightly. Nah, I'm going to fucking kill him. Renowned boxer Lennox Lewis weighed in on the matter, expressing his view that Jake Paul should consider himself fortunate that the fight will not be officially sanctioned. Drawing from his own experience in the ring, Lewis emphasized his concern for Paul's safety and well Dash being dot, despite the unconventional nature of the bout, prominent figures in the boxing world, including Anthony Joshua and Tyson Fury, have voiced their support. They recognize the potential of the event to draw attention to the sport and attract new audiences, emphasizing oh, yeah, the positive most, impact. Most definitely, bro, that junk gonna be... Man, everybody gonna be coming from TikTok, Twitter, or oh, no. Nah. Bad example. <laughs> Bad example. Twitter, y'all. That's a story for another day, man. That's a story for another day. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Anything else, bro? Instagram, people are gonna be live streaming off of everything, bro. Boxing as a whole. And Mike Tyson's that different thing. Right. It could be one of those fights where Mike Tyson gets him in a corner and connects with a punch and Jake Paul just goes limp. Mm -hmm. To the people that don't think I'm gonna win, it's like I'm younger, faster, sharper, and, and hit, can hit at the same levels that, that he can and t be able to take his punches. So I'm a little scared because it is Mike Tyson. And I feel like when I look across the ring, I'm just gonna be like, have a wow moment. Is that a little pump? Is that a little pump? I told you I have to do it. You got balls, like step in the room with Mike Tyson, boy. It is. It is definitely a lot to, to face this, and go man. up against, but. I think I'm just like wired differently to like, I, I just feel like it's like destiny for, to, for me to be involved in this. As the countdown to the exhibition match between Jake Paul and Mike Tyson continues, the boxing world braces for a spectacle unlike any other. With opinions divided and anticipation building, one thing remains certain this encounter is poised to leave a lasting impression on the sport of boxing. In this world with hormone replacement and vitamins and like, and he does all this like, um, uh, electrical muscular stimulation recovery stuff like when they were training Mike for that Roy Jones fight like they were using state-of-the-art yeah, science yeah, yeah like I don't give a <laughs> if you think he's 55 years old that guy will hurt yeah. you what are your thoughts on the classification of the Jake Paul vs Mike Tyson bout as an exhibition match share your opinions and engage with fellow boxing enthusiasts to discuss the latest developments in the world of combat sports Comment down below your thoughts, share this video with your friends, and don't forget to ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest content. Don't forget to subscribe for more updates and stay tuned for the latest news on this highly- Real talk, I don't think that was a turn of events. I'm gonna keep it a being with you because we all knew that Mike Tyson was not gonna go easy on, bro. <laughs> we seen it training. You think that's Mike Tyson going easy on some? But no, I mean, probably he wasn't going that hard, but I, I, bro, I guarantee you. You know what I'm saying? That, that, that's, that's Mike. 
But make sure you stay blessed. Make sure you stay in that kind of guy. Catch on. Love in the eyes of the kid that was lost and it turned to a rebel. Mama don't give up on me.